what up guys what's up welcome back to another one of my videos this is i think this is going to be one of my most uh important videos personally this is one of my, this is i'm making history for me like i feel like i cannot believe i copped this shoe i cannot believe i have it this shoe has a lot of history for me this shoe has no other name attached to it like it has no collaborations or anything like that i don't know if there's hype for it at this time or not but to be honest, I can throw it out the window. I don't care. This shoe has history with me. It's personal. Why? Because this is the shoe that got me into Jordans. This is the shoe that got me like questioning and thinking and, and wanting to cop Jordans and stuff, right? Even though after that, it took me a couple of years up to get back into it. Like, you know, want me to, for me to want to cop some, some Jordans and stuff. But this is a shoe that I was out there looking for. Uh, this is a very important shoe for me. You know, I'm really excited to have it. I can't believe I cop it. Well, I'm gonna be talking to you. I'm gonna be sharing my story with you as I'm unboxing the shoe, as I'm, I'm, you know, looking at it. This is gonna be literally my first impression, my first uh, thoughts, everything. I've never seen my, that shoe. I never touched that shoe. I never, I've seen it up close because of uh, back then in, in, uh, in when it came out in 04, friends of mine had it and stuff. We're not really friends, but you know, people you will see in school. <laughs> Well, anywho, let me bring the box. Here it is. I got this. If you're curious about this, at a, about this at Flight Flight Club. I always want to say Fight Club, like the movie, but it's Flight Club. We're in LA at Flight Club. All right, I'm not gonna bore you through the whole unboxing. Let's just, you know, let me edit this out and get to the shoe. I also want to say, guys, that I am starting a sneaker collection. I am starting my Jordan collection, especially Jordans. I love Jordans. So each week I'm copying a new Jordan. If you want to see what I cop next, make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the little bell so you can get notifications when I upload a new video. I'm copying more shoes and I'm able to, you know, record the video, edit the video and upload it to YouTube. So yeah, I got a bunch of other cops that I want to share with you. It's just straight up heat that I want to share with you. I really think you're going to like it. Uh, I don't know as much as I do because having it in person is one thing. Man. It's like way different than seeing it through the screen through YouTube and stuff. Having it in person is just amazing. But if you want to see, you know, what more cops I get, uh, make sure you subscribe. I welcome you to the channel. I encourage you to do so. Oh my God! Look at this box. I'm gonna cover the whole screen. You know who's that? That's Michael Jordan. <laughs> Look at this box, man. This box is sick. It's the OG. Ooh. I don't, I don't think I'm ready for this. I don't think I'm ready for this. Ooh, still teasing. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. What year is this? what year is this because this is taking me back to 2004 oh my god what year is this this is so clean it's like it just came out this year man look at it here here's a little tag from flight club uh, this is, I guess, it shows that, you know, it's being approved. It says, Do not remove tags. This product has been Flight Club approved. Please inspect shoes for any defects such as yellowing scuffs and stains prior to removing. Any claims made after this removal will not be honored. So far, it looks really clean. Oh my God, I can't believe that. Let's just get out of Good thing I have a microphone because I'm a much right now. I'm excited. Okay, here it is guys, 2004, uh, A Jordan Retro 13, I do believe this was the first um, Retro, because all the ones before this, prior to this, were the originals, were the originals, maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, but man, this shoe has a lot of meaning for me, because this is the first shoe that I ever wanted as you know, Jordans. After this was the Flints. 
I didn't cop the flints because supposedly they were gonna release again this year and they didn't, so there was no point of me um, buying, you know, the other one since I thought they were gonna release. There was no point in wasting 500 on the shoe thinking that I could get it for retail, but they never release. Hopefully they do. So yeah, what do you think? Let me let me know what you think. By the way, this costs 500 bucks. So it was really pricey. And before I get more into the shoe, I just wanna I just wanna give a big shout out to my girlfriend. Well, fiance, because we are soon to be married. We are engaged. <laughs> Cause she's the one that got it for me. She knew how much I wanted this shoe, and she went and pulled the trigger and got it for me. You wanna, you wanna say hi, baby? She's over there doing her makeup. Yeah, she's the one that I gotta give thanks to, cause she's the one that got the shoe for me. Come on, man. Let me get, let me get a cool thumbnail. Okay, flip it the other way instead, so you can see. Yeah, like it. that, like that, like that. You don't have makeup in your hand? Yes, a lot. I'm just kidding. Oh my god! <laughs> Thumbnail. So yeah, she's the one that got the shoe. She's the one that gave me, and I'm like so grateful. I'm so in love with her. Like oh my god, this shoe already meant a lot to me because of the history it has with me, and now that. Who would have thought, like, more than 13 years later, you know, because it came out 2004, 5, 6, 7. That's what, like, 13 years? Yeah. Who would have thought that 13 years later, I was going to get the shoe, but not only that, my future wife was going to get it for me. Like, Did who? you tell them that it was the last pair? It was the last pair. Yeah. They have one more, but it's a collectible. You can't wear it. It's just to have it, you know, in your decks or whatever. Just as, like, you know, just store, basically. You can wear it. You can rock it. I am. I don't know when, where, but I'm gonna rock the shit out of this shit. <laughs> and I'm just so grateful because who would have thought, you know that? Um, love you so much, baby. Mm, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> okay, this shoe, oh my god, this shoe is in such a great condition for it. It had released in 2004. So, yeah, guys, what do you think? Now, like I said, I don't know if there's hype for this shoe right now. I don't care, whatever. You know, I don't know if people want it or. or People are even talking about it, whatever. I don't, I don't know. I don't care. This shoe is perfect for me. This shoe, this is my girl. This is my girl. I, I'm sorry, I forgot to say that. I'm out of words. This is my girl. This is the shoe. This is the pinnacle for me right here. Everything else after this is like bonus, whatever, I guess. Like, I like it, but this is, to me, is tops, man. This is... This right here is the best. DS, DS, in case you don't know, DS means dead stock. Look at this. Now, I did cop the DMP pack came out this year because it looked a lot like this shoe. Um, since it looked a lot like this shoe, I thought that, you know, I don't know, I ended up finding it in Flight Club and I got it. Well, my girlfriend did. Fiance. Let me, let me go ahead and show you the other. The other, uh, the other pair. This is just, this is beautiful. Very, very beautiful. DS. What more can you ask for, man? This is a DS pair. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> no, DS. Beautiful shoe, beautiful shoe. Beautiful, beautiful. Now it's even more beautiful because every time I wear it, I'm gonna think, my fiance. Big, big props to her. This, this would not be possible for her. If it wasn't for her. Here it is. I feel like a little kid. I'm so excited, like, like for real guys, I'm really excited. This is the grail shoe for me. This is so amazing, especially because I was able to cop it. Uh, I, 
I mean, 500 is gonna sound crazy, but it is a good price, I believe. Like I said, this shoe, he has no other name besides Jordan in it, and of course Nike, but you know, this is just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful shoe. Can't wait to rock it. And uh, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your favorite 13. Let me know what you think. Let me know if it was worth it. Uh, well, to me, it was, honestly, you know, if you do have a DM DMP pack, let me know what you think. If you if you had to choose between this one and the DMP pack, which one would you choose? Um, I mean, it would be totally cool if they did retro this again. I will definitely cop again. I got really excited. But for me. <laughs> well, for retail, you know, I know I'll pay retail, but I first heard about the shoe. Um, Breakable Kicks said that it was gonna come out, but then he was wrong. The 2017 pair was was gonna come out, but it wasn't. It wasn't this one. It wasn't this one at all. Here, I put some pictures of the one that's gonna come out later, and I think Black Friday. But yeah, it doesn't look nothing like this one, does it? I'm still gonna cop that pair, I, I, you know, because weed is my favorite color. I'm still gonna get it. But I think if it would have been this one, oh man, it would have been sick. Real, real, real sick. Now I do have a surprise because I did cop one that looks similar to this. Uh, it came out only in one city in the U.S. So if you know, let me know in the comments. Take your guess if you know which one I'm talking about. Uh, and I am gonna make a video about that one probably next. But man, this is beautiful, man. Last pair in Flight Club. Boom, got it. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you want to see an on foot, on feet review, so I can do that for you guys. But for now, I just wanted to share my first thoughts and unboxing from this Enjoy 13 Retro. White and wheat. Beautiful. I can't believe it held up this much. This all these years, man. 13 years going to 14. Make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification bell for my next cuts. I can share that with you. Peace. Better yet to your friends and them. I really wanna know you all. I really wanna show you off. Fuck that. Oh, uh She wanna go and party, nigga don't approach her with that Atari Nigga that nigga game home is sorry, they say conversation Rule a nation, I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs Unless I write it down for real P.S. What's up, what's up, that's like for goddamn you got adjust it I mean I write poems in these songs Dedicated to the fun sex, your natural hair and your soft skin And your big ass and that sundress, Ooh. Good guy, what you doing that walk for? When I see that thing move, I just wish we would fight less and we would talk more. They say communication, say relations, I can tell. But I can never write my wrongs unless I write them down for real. P.S.